question I had was on this UCIA bonds that uh, the Park Madison and all that, and I'm guessing, I haven't read the ordinances, but I'm guessing you're extending the years just so those bonds are lower in 2012. Any idea you know, how many years they would be extended if they are, and how much more dollar-wise, not taking into account interest, it would, uh, any projection of how much more that would cost and the next thing, the uh, Councilman Baumgartner's uh, quote about the second largest tax increase of any community, that was from one of my charts. I look back in 2003, and Elizabeth went up 3.68 million between 2008 and 2009, to about 31 million. And they've steadied now. For the last three years, there's been hardly any increase in Elizabeth. But Summit at 3 million was so, and I, before 2003, maybe somebody did get hit harder, but some of it was, in dollar terms, the best, the highest outside of that Elizabeth thing. It was just surprising. I know there's equalization factors involved, and there are other factors. Some of it, since 2003, has only increased about 45.2%. So compar comparing to a place like Roselle, which has gone up 83%, you know, uh, they're not that bad. But that's just one of the things that I'll be bringing out on Monday. Um, and it is going to be an open forum. Uh, they're going to be, it's a PowerPoint presentation, and they're going to be like uh, uh, charts on everything. You know, camp, going from campaign contributions to uh, uh, a comparison of taxes among counties, even going back to audits uh, from 2000 and county budgets going all the way back. And it's going to be my interpretation. And based on the, what I've seen so far, there is a county that clearly is the worst fiscally as far as taxes go, uh, compared to the equalization ratios, the population, and how much their act, the tax levy would be. And it's not Union County. Um, there's also a county that's clearly the worst as far as debt goes, and they do it through improvement authorities, and uh, you know, I'm not in that county. It is that, again, it's not Union County, but Union County might be second in, on both those lists. Uh, but that's my interpretation. So I would welcome county people to come out there. There'll be like 15 minutes worth of videos, including maybe a couple for tonight. Um, and then a bunch of charts and a, and a discussion on what we can do and where we can go from here. So I would welcome county input. Um, honestly, I would. <laughs>